Hey there guys and welcome back to SnowRunner. This is episode 251, although technically I think we're probably going to maybe stop doing it as a let's play because we've kind of done most of the things we need to do now. I'll probably re-title it as just the let's play and not in a sequence now because we'll be jumping about all over the place. Um, we're going to start with doing this bronze trail. This is the, the last three tasks of this region. And I thought we might as well try it in the Gore by 4. Since that's what they've given us, it's clearly designed for this kind of thing. But is it any good? That's the big question. So we're going to start with Bronze Trail. Let's get the engine on. I've already got it ready to go. And top right corner start is right in front of us. Get the all wheel drive on to start with. And I haven't got a great history with these things so this could go drastically wrong anyway wish me luck here we go this is similar to the previous start of the other one Whoop. Whoop. come on up you get up you get up oh, oh. up you get i'm stuck Whoop. okay that's not good come on keep going Go all the way up there now. Whoop. Okay, this thing takes a bit of damage. How do we get up there? <laughs> I'm glad it uh, didn't specify that you couldn't use the winch. Oh, this was just not going to happen. Whoop. Right, okay, next winch point. And so that one, that one up there will do. I will take it from the... Oh, cancel. We'll take it from this side. Go. That's pretty good so far. Okay, it's up that way this time. <clears throat> On, up you get. There we go. Nice. Okay, did that rather well. Okay, the winch is almost a necessity. Oh, this could be almost impossible. Let's try and get a slightly better angle on these rocks. It does have the standard type. Oh, they're up. Oh! That was better than the Ford F750. Yeah! Got it? Nice! Hey, now you'll be in front and centre on the ad poster. Here's... Here's for the trouble. Okay, 500. <laughs> cool. It's now showing gold trail, but we'll do silver next. Hey... Silver. So where's that start? Down... No, that's the checkpoint. Where's the start? Must be back down there again. Ah, there it is there. Silver Trail. Um, how do we how do we get down there the easiest way? Probably round and down. Okay. Let's go. Well, the wee Gore by four has done really well on that one. <laughs> He's fast. I switched it to the SnowRunner gearbox. You may have noticed I've got the the three low ratios to play with. So it's no slouch, especially in automatic. He's almost too fast for me to control. Easy. That was a nasty rock. Fortunately, we can go through the pit area and get repaired. Jeez, oh, it's oh, <clears throat> tire. Okay, repaired. 
Is this the silver one? I think it is. Silver trail is that one there, yep. Okay, that's not where we need to go. Where's this? Do we need to go to this checkpoint? I thought we needed to start it down here. Restart. Yeah. Ah, there it is. That makes more sense. Okay, where are we going with this one? Okay, going left this time. Nice job there. Hey, where are we going? Where are we going? I don't even know where we're going. Over there. Back it up. Way off the wrong way. Luckily, these aren't timed, so not quite so bad. It's just slow and steady. Oh, no winch point here. Come on, round you go. I think the back wheel's caught in something there. Let's try a different angle. Fell back into the same spot, so let's try <clears throat> this side of this rock. Come on, get through there. I'm surprised that he's stuck on that. <clears throat> Excuse me, I've got a bit of a frog in my throat there. Don't tip over, there's no winch points. Come on, get out. I'm kind of stuck on these. Ouch. I'm getting myself into a right old mess here. Come on. Back it up. Any any winch points? There's a winch point. Is that gonna help me at all to get out? Not really. Right, turn round. <clears throat> nope. It just falls right back into the same spot each time. Maybe one with a... I don't even think a longer fuel base would help in this case. What might help is having a truck nearby to use as a winch point. No other winch... I can't believe there's no other winch points. It's insanity. And that one there, as good as it is, <clears throat> it's not letting me out of this little section. Going out. You'd think that this little bit here would not be a problem. I've got the the normal tires. Go on, jump out of there. Maybe if I use a front winch point to there, I can pull the nose around a wee bit. Yeah, like that. <clears throat> okay, that didn't quite work. Come on, pull around. Okay, can you get up there? And no winch points at all. That's the first one was so easy because there were so many winch points, but this absolutely nothing. Are you needing massive tires? I mean what's the trick to this? The engine's gonna be destroyed at this rate. Go on, get up. 
us through. Oh, no, we're not. Okay. Don't panic. We're not under time. Just need to pull it up like so. We're in, I think. Go on. Yes! Oh, what a hassle that one was. Hey, don't fall off there now after doing that. Best way over this. Page complete. Where are we going now? Back up there. Okay. So you can climb over that. No problem with it. Well, no problem within reason. Whoop. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh no. No winch points there at all. Where am I connected to? Can't see. Is it must be the one underneath me, is it? No, nope, something way over there. Right, release that. Let's see if this one will go to there. Get up. Oh, hi. Okay. Looks like it's an extension of the bronze. Try and get him to slide around to the left, but it's no. Nope. Ah, let's try. No, oh, no, no, no. Don't go down there. Made a bit of a boo boo of that. I right, back it up. Don't go. Okay. That did not go well. That's kind of where I was wanting to be facing. Up you get. There. Oh, I hate to think what gold's going to be like. Housing for that. Let's go back down. Oh, we're going to need fuel. I put the roof rack off as well, just to try and stop it being so top heavy. Hey, we need fuel. Where can we get fuel? Um. Right, we'll need to go to the top, refuel, and then back down in. Well, let's go. Try and get this done in this episode would be nice. Gee, I'm not in control at all. hard on this. We cars are sometimes the hardest to control. Down to nine litres. Come on, should make it there. I'm glad I noticed that because I wasn't paying much attention to the Join fuel level there. The right, back into the pit. The 
any damage if you don't need it. Get out of the mud. I'm playing the mud later. So these small boulders and stuff, it goes over no problem. And to be honest, in real life, I have no idea what uh, tires are like for rock crawling. I don't suppose they're anything like the mud tires with great big deep uh, treads. No! Doesn't really matter if we get a bit more damage, I suppose, but I don't want to just destroy the engine before I get through the, the area. There we go. Okay, 44 litres of fuel and we are fully fit. Where's the start for this one now? Gold. Let's restart it. No, nope, doesn't need restarting. Okay. Come on up there. It's not that. Is it that one up there? The only one that's left, so I'm, I'm guessing that's the checkpoint we need to start at. Go task. Gold. Yeah, I don't know why we need to restart it, but it seems we do, because the first one... Oh, okay, maybe that one's right. We do need to go up there. Oh, ooh. close. So there's the first one. Now where are we going? This is going to be well hard. I'm waiting for time. Oh. Here we stage complete. Where are we going up there now? Go on, up you go. Hey, get up there. Do we? Do we need to go round here and up, or is it round? I don't really want to go down again and up over that. Let's try going up to the left here, because we can't go straight over. Because that. Oh no! Don't go up there. Go up there. Okay, that worked. Now, is there a winch point? Because we're definitely going to need a winch to get up through that lot. It goes around a bit better than that. Was well, there is a winch point. Happy days. I didn't see that. Attached to a stone. Keep going, keep going. I can reverse off of that, I think. <gasps> that was close. That was very close. Come on. Oh, he's glitching. Yeah. Probably not help by him knowing. Then we put it into reverse. Right, now we need to go into reverse to get out of here again. Right forwards. Yeah. Let's try that. Yeah, right. There we go. There we go. Now I can try and get the nose over to the right a wee bit. Oh, there's a winch point there. See, I'm not even 
they've got, they are orange, but I just don't see them quite so clearly. Right, where are we going now? Way up there. Oh no. Okay. Please let her be. Ah, there it is. Good. Uh, up there. Go straight on. Any more wrench points? Oh, there's a hidden one. We jumped up there nicely. Oh, this seems almost easier than the, the silver one. Grab that one. I want you to grab that one. Like so. Get up. Is that it? Oh, wow. Finish, guys. There we go. Happy days. Not a lot of cash, fifteen hundred and a two hundred XP. What's it say for this? Well, seems like a well-prepared truck and some top-notch driving can get you anywhere. Here's your cut then. Top-notch driving. Nah, I wouldn't go that far. But guys, we've done the all of Burning Mill. Engine off. Save that fuel. We have, except for the contest. Which I think we did do... Did we do any of them? The ring? We did the ring, but that wasn't the co-op, so no, we haven't done that. But all of that. Stage 1, 2, and 3 all complete. Excellent. So now we can move on. Um, I will get Gore by 4 back to the garage. It's the only thing left. Except for the, the fuel carriers, which I'm leaving behind. Should I happen to return for a play? Uh, we now need to. I think we're going to go to Tamir. And which one of these has my missing. Is it Drownlands? Yes, I think it's Drownlands. There might be some in here. So, my idea is let's go into the garage. I think I've loc located two of them, so my plan will be bring out a scout with the um, prototype exploration unit, fire it off near the garage, and see if we can find the two elusive ones. And we'll bring out this guy, might as well. Deploy. And leave. Trailer store, and we will have one of them, please. Thank you very much. Can't believe we're already back here. Come here. Hey, where's the best place? Yeah, maybe slightly. We'll fire it here, and just let's do it. See what appears. Hey, activate the radar. And it was number four, wasn't it? Yes. So I think what we'll do is we'll we'll slightly yes is it one or two two excellent good start uh, yeah we'll maybe bring in the odd mod the other option is we try and jump into a mod map as an alternative one we haven't seen there's a few good ones out there I believe. Right, before we go any further, let's find out where are these... There they are. So close to the garage, but you just didn't know they were there. There's the first one. We'll go... We'll ditch the trailer. No point in dragging that up there. Let's go for a play in this Land Rover. A 
he's almost as bad as the Gorby 4 for going everywhere but straight. Can you cut up here? Get up. Got to redeem yourself from the off road navigation task that we got so close with and failed. Oh, can't believe this was so close. What did we get? Raised suspension for the Dawn 71. Okay, well, we don't have one of them. Next. Oh, sorry about your fence. I'm sure it was rotten and was about to fall down anyway. Right, what I will do, I think, is get this guy back to the garage. We will try. Oh, I'm going to park him there because I'm. Not, I want to get this guy out so, to show you. Uh, we need to go back in the garage. Truck store. So these are the mods. So everything with this blue. In fact, mods only. There we go. This is. I've never even tried these. I just downloaded them. They look very similar to the stock and active V8. That's the differences there. And you've got that looks like a freelander what we would have had as a freelander not a defender kiki Moore. totally awesome the mustang again i've used it a little bit pretty good pretty good indeed and then the land rover defender 110 so the long wheel base version this guy is a little bit overpowered but i'll show you let's purchase and deploy he's not overly expensive only thirty one thousand. Looks very plain until you start to upgrade it. Turbo diesel. Yes, of course. Take the biggest engine. Fill that one. The main thing for this is it's add-ons. A crawler kit. Is that the one I like? I'm not sure, but we'll go with that. Suspension has to be raised. Or you've got the tuner, which is lower, but I think you can lift it. Softer suspension made for crawling with heavy duty RCLT IFS made by Marlim, making this tune able to crawl well. So I presume that's independent suspension then. Uh, this. No, oh, I, I, I kind of want to go with the raise, but I'm curious about this now. So let's buy that. We'll sell that. Tires. Oh, look at the options there. It's just mud terrain, worn, new. I have no idea. Off-road mud unchained. Oh yeah. Well, I think we'd go for one of these. Grappler. I never actually looked at the... Oh, the stats there don't change. Excellent for them all. Kind of OP. Winch. Plumus extended. Diff is in there. Frame add-ons. A roof rack. Ladder, ladder, roll cage. Roll cage is cool. Not the one I'm after, though. E -do 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 -do. Custom tuning. This one. No, but it looks quite cool. Interior. Quartermasters. Quartermaster supplies. Maybe it's in here, then. Jerry can, so fuel extra. Oh, I can't fit it. For some reason, this requires another add-on to be installed. The boot supplies, take that. Powder ex... Oh, fit. Dry powder extinguisher. Pickaxe. Yeah, let's throw it all on. Oh, it's one or the other. Shovel or pickaxe? Take shovel. And the sling. What do we need? Rock sliders, not so fast. I just want to get them out and show you. Interior. This could be it. So it's got a little CB radio, Citizens Band radio. Used to have them in the 80s in the UK where the truckers would be all contacting each other. And 
if you had them in the house as well, just to speak to the guys that are driving nearby. Let's go out with this. And I'll show you what that radio can do. That is a crawler one that I like. That's like the snow runner. So we've got the prototype. Look at the mist. We're eerie. So the prototype exploration unit. This thing has it fitted with the CB radio. You can activate it without having to have the trailer. So it does away with this trailer completely. It's overpowered, but it's nice that you can just drive around and scan wherever you are without dragging that dead weight behind you. I don't think it gives a a wider area. I can't be quite sure. But anyway, let's go after the... Oh no, what's the time? Tell you what, guys. Let's go after the next upgrade with this I'll pop it back into the garage and throw all the extra stuff on it, save a bit of time, and we'll go out in the next episode and we'll take this to go and get the next uh, upgrade. And we've got to find the other two. I think they're on this map as well somewhere. It'll be good fun. A bit of an exploration uh, episode. So, if you enjoyed it, and the fact that we've kind of completed all of them, give us a wee thumbs up. Let me know that you enjoyed it like I did. And subscribe. That'll be about there if you haven't done so already, because that helps me enormously. Uh, thanks again for watching guys, see you again soon. Bye for now.